But I think, you know, so like we have probably an established microbiome on a farm, you know, because we get very little stresses and interruptions in that. So then we come back to with different products that might be put into the feed and it may not be the best, you know, the best or most suitable product for our situation, you know, because we, we have this established microbiome and it seems to be a relatively healthy microbiome anyways. And so I think it's, again, a little bit different setting from the, the standpoint of going out in the industry. I mean, they, they probably have established microbiomes on their farms as well, and then trying to get those to take and shift or overcome, you know, the disruptions that typically occur on a farm. Uh, I think that's where we, we need to think more about some kind of model or something that would help with describing that. 